Hi, I'm Jody Amen from HealthyPlace.com, and I'm a counselor. Many of my clients ask me if they should tell their employer if they that they have a mental illness, and that's a difficult question to answer. It really depends. I guess it depends on what needs they might have on the account of that, um, what's going on for them, and how it might affect their work. Really, when they're applying for a new job. They really want their credentials and like the recommendations to really stand for them in, in terms of how they are as a worker. So they might not want to tell a new employer. See, new employers might get a little afraid. They might not understand much about mental illness. Mental illness diagnoses mean different things to different people. And so this employ employer might not really understand that it means, you know, you're a regular person and sometimes things are a struggle or you're a regular person and sometimes you have a bit of anxiety. And they might wonder if you're going to commit some violence or if you're going to um, miss a lot of work because of this illness they don't understand. They might think you might have difficulty concentrating and in fact that might happen. You might some days have difficulty concentrating. But if you have some experience and you have some really good recommendations, then it might not even matter to tell them. Because um, then people wonder if they should tell their coworkers or if they should tell their friends. And really, I think people feel really different if they have a me mental illness. And this is one problem, is that it makes people feel like they're the oddball or, or different than everybody else. But really so many people struggle with depression and so many more people struggle with anxiety. It's almost the norm. It actually, I would venture to say that it is the norm. That people, all kinds of people in all walks of life experience anxiety and they make different meanings around it. Some of them might not even think of themselves as having a mental illness. So, so the question is, is do you tell your employer and if you don't tell your employer, how does it affect you? And if you don't tell your employer because you're embarrassed or shamed, which is very common if you're experiencing depression, anxiety, um, bipolar, or Asperger's or something, there's a lot of shame involved. And so not telling might increase that shame or might make you feel like that's more, um, it's more something to hide about yourself. And that does make the, uh, make, your feelings worse and it might make your um, the effects of the mental illness a bit worse. So first of all we have the, the, we have the anxiety or we have the OCD and then on top of it we have all these judgments on ourselves. why it's not okay to have this and everybody else is stronger than you and you're different than everybody else which isolates us, makes us feel really horrible and just makes the whole thing a lot worse. So I think people need to think of themselves as regular people first and foremost. And, um, you know, we need to do the education to help other people not make such a stigma around it. But we also need to help people feel like they're just regular people. We're all struggling. We're all adjusting to different things in our life. And that's, um, you know, it's nothing to be ashamed of. I think that's just the most important part. So again, I'm Jody Amen from HealthyToPlace.com talking about stigma of mental illness in the workplace. Thanks.